At least two people have been killed in Myanmar after troops fired shells into a Rohingya village. Seven others were injured in the blast. It happened in uh, Buridang village in the western Rakhine state. The military's artillery, artillery hit a house. The victims were all civilians. Our correspondent Tanvir Chowdhury is in Dhaka and says the attack comes just two days after the UN's highest court ordered Myanmar to protect its Rohingya minority. At least two people killed and seven injured. Among them were two women, one was pregnant. All of them were Rohingya villagers in Butitong town in western Rakhine. Now this comes after Myanmar army fired artillery shells in the Rohingya villages. Now this is an area a lot of Rohingyas live there. Are still around 600,000 Rohingyas living in Rakhine state. This is an area also prone to insurgency. The Myanmar military has been fighting Northern Alliance as well as Buddhist Rakhine rebel groups in these areas. Now, at least from witness reports and other reports we are getting, there wasn't any clash on insurgency engagement today. This happened totally in a peaceful time. There has been reports of previous clashes, but not today. Now, more importantly, this comes just two days after the UN's top court approves a provisional measure which compels Myanmar to protect ethnic minorities, prevent rape, killing and torture and destroying on villages and home. This is a very important development considering this comes just a couple of days after the UN top court's decision in Hague.